I'm already, I've forgotten how to do this sort of stuff. <laughs> Andrew Furnival, been farming here for uh, since I took over from my dad uh, 12, 13 years ago. Got 300 cows now, so we've increased in the last 12 months by probably 50 or 60 using Salisol. This will be our third year, uh, really pleased with it. Last year, I suppose, was a challenging year with being so dry in the summer, which meant we fed a lot, fed a lot of silage. But, uh, you know, we've made good silage and helped, I think, with Salisol to keep the cows going, really. We've, they've milked well and they're still milking well. And, some of the silage we made uh, end of last year um, that had sat out in the dry for a couple of months. Even that seems to be feeding pretty well. I'm quite pleased with it really. In general, the cows uh, milking really well this winter. Um, everything's gone pretty well really. It milked better than I expected. Uh, so yeah, milked on well. I've been pleased with them really. The fertility's going well. Um, yeah, and no real issues at the moment. We don't want to have much waste at all really. It has some clamp slippage, uh, which has caused a bit, but. Yeah, we, we fought most of that off beforehand, but um, yeah, generally it keeps really well. I'm really pleased with the slippage, you know, out. It's been open really long, but considering what I would expect, it doesn't go off that much. And then it feeds really well. The, the, the cows uh, are always keen and um, they, don't, they don't really get much waste at all in, in, in the troughs. They, they, they eat, it, eat it up every day. We don't, we're not one of these farms that has to scrape a load away every day. They seem to be uh, utilising the feed well, I think. And, milking well off and getting good good results off the of forage. The milk price is obviously crashing um, and coming back. We don't quite know where it's going to aim, but Salisol is still worth using. Still got to get as much out of forage as you can. I think it's probably a false economy stripping things out that you think you can manage without and end up, you know, not having as good a forage. It's not the best idea probably. So I'm going to keep going with it anyway. So. Yeah, if I was uh, recommending to another farmer, I'd say it's definitely worth a try. Um, yeah, we, we've definitely seen a difference um, in um, the milk we've got from farm forage and just the looking at the clamp, it, it, the, the seam's less waste than um, I would expect. And you'll soon see for yourself, I think. <laughs>